before starting the dressing process, may I suggest that it should be done outside if possible, away from the machine tools. This video clearly showing the amount of grinding dust that can be let free into the air. I would normally move my grinder outside, but as the lights for producing my videos are set up in the workshop for the task, I took a chance. I did though thoroughly vacuum the surrounding area after completing the process. Now to the wheel dressing. Unlike most sharpening tasks where the fence is set at a small angle to the side of the wheel to ensure grinding is done on the wheel's corner, in this case for this type of wheel it must be parallel to the wheel's side. From here the video makes the process clear. Having said earlier that the fence should be set parallel to the wheel side, some, when using a wheel seen here, will set the narrow surface to be concave. I have no experience of this, but assume it is essential on machines with a fixed X and Y axis at 90 degrees and a fixed wheel. Some machines do have the facility to rotate the grinding wheel head, which would avoid the necessity.